Good morning, SHS. Today is Monday, December 11th. Happy birthday, Frank Sinatra. Have, Have yourself a, a merry little, little Christmas. Christmas. <laughs> I'm Haley Fox. I'm Thomas Hammer. And you're watching My, My morning, morning Jacket. Jacket. Don't forget, the Leo Club meets every Friday morning starting at 8 a.m. in the theater. If you ordered a cheesecake from the National Technical Honor Society, the pickups will be during 4th block and after school until 4.30 today. Tuesday, SHS welcomed the new athletic director, Cheyenne Trussell. My Morning Jacket anchor, KB Hobart, has more. Tuesday, in the Jacket Nation, faculty, students, and parents gathered in the library to welcome Dr. Cheyenne Trussell as the new athletic director. We went through an interview process. I had a committee uh, of administrators and a coach, and, uh, and we interviewed um, four, can four candidates. We had about 16 up uh, to 17 applicants. Dr. Trussell just rose above the, the, in the, in the group of great uh, uh, athletic directors. Good afternoon. Dr. Trussell began by thanking Stratwell Oxiba Hall School District for the opportunity and expressed words of appreciation to his former district, Hattiesburg. It's a great day to be a Jack. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Sounds like he's going to be a pretty good guy, so uh, we look forward to it. Uh, you know, come from Hattiesburg, where uh, he had a lot of success, and you know, I'm sure uh, coming here, he'll just bring that here to our tradition and all the good things we have going here. To the parents, you know, we just thank you for entrusting us with your most valuable resource. I'm extremely excited, you know, being here within just a little over an hour. It seemed like I've been here for a matter of, of months, you know. Uh, just the atmosphere, my position became available. I was interested. I actually rode up the week of the uh, Bama State game. I didn't know, but I saw all the traffic. And I rode around through the facilities around the school, and I got the feel, you know. First it was the feel. And then just doing my research, looking at your website, you know. I just said, this is the part that I, I, I want to be a part of, no doubt. Dr. Trussell has priorities to accomplish. Well, you got a couple of things. I'm going to have to multitask. One is meet with the coaches, continue the student athletes, take a look at the budget. What you put in your mind and what you have in your heart, no one can ever take away. My Morning Jacket welcomes Dr. Trussell to the Jacket Nation. You know, you have this one district, you have one team. That is the jacket. This is Kelly Beth Hobart with My Morning Jacket reporting from the library at Strava High School. All AP U.S. government and AP psychology students need to come to Mr. G's room starting today. Pick up your textbook, important course information, and assignment that is due January 5th. The Light Leadership Institute at the University of Mississippi allows 20 rising seniors to take six hours of coursework while living on the Ole Miss campus during the upcoming summer. Please see Ms. Norma Cole for details about nominations for the Institute. Ever wonder who has the best Christmas cookies in the Jacket Nation? Let's find out. So guys, with the broadcast party coming up, we got to figure out what we're bringing. So on the count of three, we're all going to say what we're going to bring. And maybe it'll be something different. All right, you ready? One, two, three. Cookies! <laughs> well, I make the best cookies, so clearly I should be the one bringing cookies. Calvin, that's like the dumbest thing I've heard all day. I make the best cookies. No, you are both wrong. I make the best cookies. I can't bake for crap, but my mom makes the best cookies. Well, I guess we gotta settle this with a cookie baking contest. Alright, okay. let's do this. One eternity later. Where is LB? She was supposed to be here like an hour ago. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry guys. I was... By, I mean, <laughs> baking my cookies. <laughs>
subscribe. This is my favorite. The shortbread. And the winner of the cookie contest is Kaylin. Five cookies won! Five cookies won! Hey, I get that hat. And now to sports with Jasmine Baker. Wondering if you made the 2017-2018 baseball team? Well, the list is posted outside of Room 100 on the bulletin board. Boys soccer took on their first district team of the season last Friday night. My Morning Jackets' Caroline Dewberry has more. The boys and girls soccer team competed in their first district match Thursday night against the Madison Central Jaguars. The girls came into the game with five wins this season. In the first half of the game, Madison Central's defense overpowered the Lady Jackets and they scored five goals. The Lady Jackets came back with a strong front line in the second half and scored on the Jaguars. Starfall had a strong back line, but against all efforts, they fell to the Madison Central Jaguars 6-1. Senior starter Emily Cartwright talked about the overall game. I think we played all right. We definitely had some struggles, but in the end, I think we came out strong. The boys' soccer team entered the game with a record of 4-2. and two. In the first half of the game, the boys' starting line held the Jaguars' defense and ended the first half with a score of 0-0. Zero to zero. In the second half of the game, Madison Central came out strong and scored three points on Starkville. The Jackets defended their side, but in the end, they fell to the Madison Central Jaguars 3-0. Senior Captain Reese Dunn reflected on the team's performance. Um, it was really hard. We were trying to prepare because it's a district game, and it was really important. And I mean, we played our hearts out. Peyton, our goalie, had the greatest game ever, and we just played really well. It was unlucky. Two of the goals were just very unlucky, but overall, we played really well. Both the Jackets and Lady Jackets will compete against Madison Central again when they travel to Jackson on January 12th. I'm Caroline Dewberry with My Morning Jacket reporting from Yellow Jacket Field. Hammer like peas, peas and, and carrots. carrots. Catch us next time with the latest news in the Jacket Nation.